Hey MailChimp wizards, enthusiasts, and new learners, welcome back to our channel. Today, I'll show you how to authenticate your domain in MailChimp. Domain authentication is a crucial step to improve email deliverability and establish trust with your subscribers. But before we jump into the action, if you are new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you never miss out on our latest adventures and it'll keep you on the loop for future content. And to our returning viewers, welcome back and we appreciate y'all for your ongoing support and could not wait to embark on this journey with all of you on board once again. Now let's get right into authenticating a domain and mail chip. It's really crucial for uh, several reasons. Number one is focusing on improving email deliverability and enhancing sender credibility. So basically, it demonstrates to email service providers, which are ESPs, and the uh, internet service providers, which are the ISPs, that your emails are legitimate and not spoof or sent by malicious actors, right? So as a result, your emails are more likely to reach your subscribers' inbox instead of being flagged as spam, right? So authenticating your domain helps reduce the likelihood of your emails being marked as spam by recipients and resulting in fewer spam complaints from subscribers. A good sender reputation is critical for long-term email deliverability success as it determines how email providers treat your emails. So whenever you send emails with an authenticated domain, it reinforces your brand's identity and trustworthiness. Subscribers are most likely to open and engage with emails from a recognized authenticated sender, right? We have to, we have to agree here. The domain authentication helps prevent email spoofing, a tactic used by spammers to impersonate legitimate senders. By authenticating your domain, you make it difficult for them, right? To impersonate your brand, and when subscribers see your domain in their inbox, they are more confident that the email is genuine and more likely to open it. Because people are very cautious nowadays to avoid online hacks. And these uh, regulations like the, uh, the Can Spam Act and the GDPR, they often require um, accurate sender identification with which domain authentication ensures. And for email testing, you know, uh, domain authentication allows you to conduct accurate email testing. It ensures that your test reflects how your emails will perform in the real world, enhancing the reliability of your email marketing efforts. Now, in, in speaking of reputation management, you know, it allows you to establish a track record of sending legitimate emails, which is a valuable asset in the email marketing world. Now, to authenticate your domain, all you got to do is go to your website. When you go, when you hover to website, it will show you your domain here. Yes. But if you have a different uh, subscription that I have, because if you've watched most of our videos, we are just using um, a tutorial dummy account. We're not using a live account. So in that regards, all I got to do, an option two would be go to your profile. Once you are inside your profile, all you got to do is go to um, domains. And then you can choose the domains that you wanted to connect. Let's say search for new domain, upgrade to website and e-commerce. Of course, you are required to uh, add another um, subscription for that because, again, we're just using uh, a free, free um, account. So all you got to do is add and verify domain. So it will be you will be asked here, right? And I believe that's a wrap for today's tutorial.